In July of 2021, Russia's United Aircraft Corporation launched a mysterious campaign to tease a secret project that would debut at the MAX 2021 air show in Moscow. After much speculation and the relentless hype surrounding the new reveal, some sources discovered that it was likely some sort of drone or artificial intelligence simply codenamed Checkmate. But it was more than that. The vehicle in question was a Sukhoi fifth generation stealth fighter called the SU-75 Checkmate, also known as the Light Tactical Aircraft, or LTS, in Russian. Although not much is known about it, the Checkmate is designed to be the direct competitor of the American F-35 Lightning and the Swedish JAS-39 Gripen, and is expected to fly in 2023 with the latest stealth aircraft innovations. Teasing a secret aircraft. During the first days of July 2021, United Aircraft Corporation, or UAC, released a strange marketing campaign for an unannounced project. The organization that comprises Russia's top aerospace and military firms published a teaser on its social media accounts with a trivial message that said, quote, everything is easier than it seems. Something seems to be on the way. The phrase written in Russian was accompanied by the hashtag Checkmate, and the clever marketing campaign pointed to a famous 1970s hoax UFO photo by the Swiss ufologist Billy Meyer. The UFO and X-Files connotations that related to the paranormal led the audience to believe that the UAC was about to unveil a new generation aircraft, a drone, or even a spacecraft with artificial intelligence, given the company's past with military and commercial aviation. Then, on July 13th, the Rostec Corporation launched a countdown website and a video for the unannounced project. The footage showed Air Force pilots from Argentina, India, Vietnam, and the United Arab Emirates getting ready for the arrival of what appeared to be an unnamed fighter jet. All these countries share something in common, as they're all existing operators of Russian fighters. As everything fell into place, it all pointed towards the release of a new fighter jet at MAX 2021. MAX 2021 Moscow Air Show. MAX in Russian stands for International Aviation and Space Show. It is also Russia's marquee air show and weapons expedition. One of the main objectives of MAX is to showcase Russia's new technologies to the international market to attract the attention of militaries and governments from all over the world. MAX also holds scientific conferences led by Russia's Central Aero Hydrodynamic Institute about the latest aviation news. Days before the exhibition began, the new warplane, wrapped under a tarpaulin, was photographed as it was towed to a parking spot across the Zhukovsky airfield near Moscow. Rostec published the pictures with a very suggestive caption that read, quote, Wanna see me naked? After weeks of building up hype, the secret aircraft was finally unveiled on the inauguration day by none other than President Vladimir Putin. The ceremony and show were impressive, and the surprise aircraft was the Sukhoi Checkmate, a fifth-generation light tactical fighter. During Checkmate's inaugural show, a Rostec spokesperson gave an overview of the aircraft, accompanied by proper ambient lighting to highlight the airframe. Max visitors were finally able to look at the Checkmate's mock-up and were fascinated by the airframe and its expected performance and capabilities. The new aircraft was immediately compared to the American F-35, the multi-role stealth fighter employed by the U.S. Air Force. Besides its narrow fuselage, split-angle tails, and wings in the shape of a diamond, the Checkmate appeared to fall into the category of F-35 lookalikes. However, according to the presentation, the Checkmate will not have better performance and firepower than the F-35 and other NATO aircraft, but will be cheaper to produce and buy. The Checkmate Stealth Fighter The Sukhoi Checkmate is Russia's first state-of-the-art stealth engine fifth-generation fighter, and Rostec began working on this light single-engine aircraft back in 2016 after studying Russian air missions in Syria. According to Mikhail Streletz, Checkmate's chief designer, quote, an analysis of the use of airstrikes in Syria revealed that the capabilities of heavy twin-engine aircraft systems turned out to be overly excessive for carrying out most tasks. 
During the Syrian conflict, Russia's most used aircraft was the Su-35, a single-seat, twin-engine, super-maneuverable aircraft that was 21.9 meters long with a wingspan of 14.75 meters. In comparison, the Checkmate stands at 17.5 meters long with a wingspan of 11.8 meters. Although the power plant has not been confirmed, intelligence suggests that it will have a Saturn 30 engine, which is 30% lighter and 20% more effective than current Russian engines. It is also expected to give between 14,500 and 16,000 kilogram force of thrust and a low radar signature. Rostec has specified that the aircraft will have an approximate top speed of 2,200 kilometers per hour and a flying range of up to 2,800 kilometers without external fuel tanks, and will feature a multi-purpose armament suite compatible with a wide range of guided missiles, surface-to-air missiles, anti-ship missiles, unguided rockets, and bombs. Checkmate will also have a combat payload of 7,400 kilograms and provide five hardpoints in the internal weapons bay and six external pylons. A total of 11 hardpoints will ensure that the Checkmate can counter all sorts of threats at standoff ranges to ensure the pilot's safety. More importantly, they will bolster the Checkmate's capability to engage up to six targets simultaneously. In addition, Checkmate was designed using almost the same technical specifications embedded in the Su-57E fighter jet. According to Strelitz, quote, The tendency of harmonizing aircraft inventory is on the rise. Due to a high level of inter-project harmonization, the joint operations of the Su-57, the Checkmate, and unmanned aerial vehicles may form an optimally balanced fleet for various tasks with a minimum operating cost and high combat potential. Furthermore, the Director General of UAC, Yuri Slyusar, said that the Checkmate was primarily designed as a platform for an entire family of aviation systems, while pointing out that they are also planning on developing an unmanned version. Quote, the unmanned version is not only a tribute to modern tendencies, we are integrating a wide range of capabilities for net-centric operations into the aircraft at the project's early stage. The jet will be capable of sharing information and providing target designation to other air platforms and unmanned aerial vehicles. It appears as though the new jet will control small UAVs and other types of drones that will function as loyal wingmen to assist the pilot during missions. The avionics suite also includes an Integral Active Electronically Scanned, or ASEA, radar, allowing the Checkmate to track up to 30 targets and engage six simultaneously, thanks to an optical electronic targeting system, while the cockpit features the latest multifunctional touchscreens with information about targets, threats, routes, and other systems in a broad panoramic view. Stealth Fighter Competition Despite Checkmate's vast array of features, it will face tough competition in the international market. Some of its worthy competitors are the American F-35A, the Swedish JAS-39E, the French Rafale, and the Chinese JF-17. However, Checkmate's strong point is its cost. Strelitz has explained that, quote, the developers paid specific attention to maintaining a rational balance between proven technical solutions and breakthrough technologies, as well as between the price tag and capabilities. Thanks to this fact, the Checkmate has a unique combination of flight performance and combat efficiency at an affordable price and a low flight hour cost. The Checkmate's price point will start at $30 million, followed by the F-17 and the JAS-39E, which range from $50 to $60 million. Meanwhile, the US F-35A and the French Rafale prices go up to between $80 and $100 million. If the information that Russia has provided is accurate, the Checkmate will be the real winner when it comes to performance, range, and payload, and deliveries are expected to start by 2023. Thank you for watching our video. Please like and subscribe to our Dark Documentaries channels to find more exciting historical content. And let us know in the comments below what you think of the new Russian stealth aircraft. Will it be able to outmatch the American F-35?